Ben. Oh my god. That's what I'm here for. I want to say 16. I want to see. These are actually not traders. I want to. I mean, I, really, I did it, like, it early this year. F16, right? You know, I've been playing Fantasy for like 30 years. It's like my favorite game of all time, right? Basically. Yeah, the Fantasy means a lot to me, right? It's been like my favorite franchise for all the years. It's Sweden's games. You know, I love Final Fantasy, the Sega games, all these games, right? You know, Sega Frontier and so on as well. Vagrant Story, etc., right? You know, I played every goddamn game ever they ever made, right? So I'm getting really excited now. Come on, freaking give me a new Final Fantasy. Oh, I, should, I win the whole shirt. I should have worn my fat shirt. You know what I mean? Maybe I won the fat shirt. Whatever, it's over here. No time for what we get, but whatever. We're gonna watch. We're gonna get later. Okay, FF. Here we go. This is I mean, the game is announced, but I wanna see this thing. Because I have volume. Max volume, max volume. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be probably my favorite game. This is Zelda, I guess, yeah, next year. Where's that? Get the run shit down. Yeah. Oh my god, it's blood. It's gonna be darker and bloodier too, baby! Yeah, it's gonna be darker and bloodier as well, man. They change the gameplay course again, right? With the whole more Devil May Cry thing. Whatever, I mean, they do it every time. I don't mind it that much, honestly, because they always change the, the combat if I fancy. But I might miss the portal members, but I think you've seen portal members, yeah, we can see it. There's 15 times, of course. Yeah, the Udin, definitely. Is that Ramu? That Shiva throwing the ice ball, definitely, right? My waifu! I'm getting so much goosebumps, but Jesus Christ, man, this is the game I'm waiting for. Maybe even more than Zelda for me, personally. Maybe, maybe. Oh, that's Bahamut, I think. What? I think it's Bahamut coming out. Since Bahamut, yeah. You know how the different summonings. I, I compared it a bit to Shifter and Take a Titan, right? In my, in my previous reaction of it. Um, oh, it's the Ifrit. I'm, I'm getting so much goosebumps, man. This is, this is the game I'm waiting for. This, Street Fighter 6, I guess, and Zelda, yeah. This is my three games, right? Only Yelp in this case. I don't care about this, yeah. The Western people are all great, great stuff, whatever. Hey, this is what I want, man. Lightning bolts, explosions. Oh my god, it's beautiful. I hope it has uh, more shares of gameplay though. Uh, 15 was way too easy. 13 is pretty hard, you know, yeah, 15. 13 isn't the hardest game ever, but it was pretty hard. Yeah, next year, finally. It's been so long, finally. <laughs> yeah, 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 oh, but I'm playing already, okay. But yeah, you have probably have more playable characters, or the com companion AI, maybe? That's how it feels. Oh, he's burning up. Because we had the, b the flying bird thing that they turned into, I think. Yeah, but they really is clear that they have their own shifter thing or they have their own summoning. Kind of like Legend of Legacy, but they have their own, you know, personal summoning inside of them, right? Yeah, so he's like the, the, the fire bird or so on. They have their own different... Oof. I mean, that that's the game for me, guys. I never hear the classic or Final Fantasy music. Oh, oh there's so much. You can pre-order today? You, you finally get the date, baby? There's still half a year left, though. God damn it. There's still six months left, though. Oh. PlayStation exclusive. There's still a half year left, baby. Oh, we saw it earlier. Yeah, so this is uh, Super Giant. Yeah, this is the Castlevania um, uh, thing they showed earlier. Right? Definitely. I think so, at least. Isn't it? Because earlier they showed us that fighting scene. I'd be like. Yeah. Or main? No? Maybe I won't, but I am missing the map now, it's too complex. I don't even know what Very nice. It looks nice, but I'm almost like, show me gameplay right there. Show me gameplay. Okay, a trap, interesting. Yeah, I guess there was like a trap magic put there. Can I guess the gameplay mechanics? Training. So this is like the new horse there. Yeah, it could be a great game. Probably is. There's not a horse now. Definitely. We can but learn. I mean, that we game is fantastic. Is yeah, like I love that game. That game is so addictive. That does look good though. That does look good. Is the gameplay? Yeah, it's hard as 2.0 or something. This looks awesome though. Yeah, this is hard as uh, 2 basically. 
But this game is great. The horse is a great game, guys. It's a really good Apollo. It is hard as just two, basically, right? But I guess you're not playing the daughter instead, is that something? Yeah, that's my the new character, but... Okay, this game I'm definitely getting. Definitely. Killing the door, Sean. Godlike. I mean, hard as is. Yeah, roadlike. It's a really good game. It's addictive, that's crazy. But I guess it's just gonna be like called hard as two, right? Many Zeus now, so. <laughs> Zeus, yeah, you're saying it's inside. Or Kronos, that is a Titan. Wait for me, father. I'll be this. Hardest two, yeah. Hardest two, baby, I call it. But it would be kind of funny if it was called something else. It was like Zeus. <laughs> now, though, this is very ARPG. This is probably where Mirmonen gets in. It's like, oh, is it time for some near game or something? <laughs> and it feels like, is it time finally for a Japanese game? Is a waifu? Look at that, yeah. Some blonde chick or something. Oh, she walks with these flowers. It's like need a lot of it. I have to say only. I'm, I'm just gonna be honest. This is the game that I'm probably most. Yeah, this is like a lot like Nina, a lot like Nina in there. But honestly, this is probably the game where I'm like, woo, yeah. I like it. It's rusty, but you kind of walk. You yeah, like it's kind of like you're a guy or something, and it's like destroyed world. This is a lot like Nina, honestly, Nina the mountain. Yeah. Um, this generally, I would say, is, is my favorite so far. Maybe I'm just a sucker, but I like this for this like dystopian world, right? And then you have this girl that she's walking and she's creating flowers and yeah. And you know I love Nier so I mean obviously I love early port and start with or like an old zombie. Maybe she can revive it something. Oh yeah, she can free it maybe. She can free spirit from his like portal there, right? So yeah, they can free different animals. But they're all like giants for some reason. Maybe she is tiny because the fact that the guy was big too. Maybe she's like a little guy I got this. Honestly, this is this is kind of exciting to me. After all, Hardest Two is my oh switch game. Bayonetta? Is it Bayonetta Four, baby? Am I ready for Bayonetta Four already? I mean, you know, we don't know how the game ended, so it's gonna be called uh, the daughter's name is. <laughs> it's gonna have a spoiler. A spoiler. It's gonna be called. Uh, <laughs> uh, Jan, Jan, you're gonna have to change name. <laughs> you're gonna have to change name. Oh god, I'm sitting here ready with the Battle of Three, man. See this wind strike. Yeah, they quit this now. Here we go. Battle of the Order again. So it is Battle of Four, right? The plot of the game was like that Helena Taylor, we gotta show her. Yeah, we gotta make more games. It's a piece of rock, right? I can't turn back now. Oh, it's not it's even like the same gameplay anymore? What? It's like a tiny, she's a young, she's a Celeste said? Yeah. What? It's a completely older game, it's like sand shaded. It reminds me of like Ikko or something like that. Oh, they're going completely different here. My god. A little bit of Okami, maybe call it. It's a very shady game, yeah. This is like a Zelda game then, more adventure, yeah. Stuff to go. You're summoning stuff again, 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 I guess so, yeah, back to that thing. It's like rude! Have you played rude? That's how it is. It's like rude, baby. Yeah, it's like rude. Put your mom is in the bed thing as well. This is very interesting. I guess it's a Switch exclusive. It's like, yeah, it's probably a Switch exclusive, right? You can see up here, right there. Switch exclusive, very likely, right? Uh, like the case with the games, like 2 and 3 has been Nintendo. I will give you it reminds me of Rune the most, who's summoning stuff fighting and so on, who played uh, Rune 1 and 2, which is actually a software game before they made you know, Demon Slayer, uh, so on, yeah. Uh, Dark Souls, I mean, and, you know, etc. Bayonetta Origins, yeah, interesting, very interesting. Oh, yeah, and the series. More 17. I'm, I don't know if it's like a food game? No, yeah, I feel it's gonna be like a you know a shorter game, right? Definitely feels like it's not gonna be a full you know full cost game, but more a game you pay maybe like 20 30 bucks for. Give this a ready. This actually could be something that's really awesome if it's a game I'm thinking about. Let's see. I think it's like this is all the console we're working on. It's like a cute uh, Tanuko or something. Oh, here we go. It looks like Scarlet Nexus. Graphical style, definitely the same. It's almost the same animation, I think, definitely. 
And Amazon games? What? Uh, not Amazon, but why they're gonna... Oh, whatever. Next Tales game? <laughs> oh, man. I love Tales of Horizon. Jesus Christ, man. I played this year, though. Yeah, I played this on my summer vacation this year. Ooh. There's a lot like Scarlet Nexus. I have it here, right? Yeah. Where is it in the bottom here? There it is. Yeah, it's Scarlet Nexus, yeah. So let's go next to mm. My graphics app, but definitely. Yeah. Finally, the colorful game. Finally, the Genki game, right? I say that and it's all dark, but no, what was Genki before this? Okay, see, look, Genki. It's like grass or something. It is grass, yeah. Like every other goddamn game is like freaking gray, bleak stuff, yeah. The little Japanese people make games with like color, like green and red or something. And blue, yeah, like this game is probably pretty good. It's like a nice, you know, Japanese game. The game I wanna play, yeah. The game actually, you can look at it, yeah. The game I can enjoy. <laughs> game actually looks like it's pretty cute, cool characters, waifus, like a playable game. Why not? You know, one is yeah, like freaking waifu games, man. No, but honestly, I think the so many of these trailers has been games that are I keep saying gray, right? Yeah, they're like bleak and gray. Well, what is wrong with the Western developers? Blue Protocol. It's been traded from here. Oh, Banda Namco. Yeah, I mean, they've been there many times before. Tales, maybe? Maybe a new Tales game? I'm going to goosebump. Is that a new Tales game? Tales of something else? Is it finally not a grey shitty game? Is it finally colourful? You know, some ugly grey stuff that every other game company does? It's going to be Tales, right? I think it's going to be a new Tales game. Like Tales of something else. Of uh, Awakening. Tales of Oregon. Something else. This is what I'm right there. I'm gonna go. I mean, Case of a Rise is an amazing game. I didn't play it. I just played it recently. It's such a good game. Holy shit, it's such a good game. Like, because um, I played it this my summer recently this year, yeah. Come on, tell, tell me it's a new Tales game. This feels like a Tales intro, right? Oh, I love this opening. Second opening, so good. Storyline so good. So, oh, it's Tales of Rise is so well written. My god, that's not a good game. I had the ultimate edition for the man. Yeah, I bought the, I bought the freaking old shit, man. Yeah, it's been gone, man. It's, it's a taste game. Feed the fire. Come on, show me what game it is. I feel it's a taste game. I mean, it's a taste game, right? I want I want a taste game. But Button Amke also releases Elden Ring, so. That's a Cinderburn? This sounds like it's Elden Ring now. Elden Ring 2 or something. My god, I hope it's a taste game. What, I get, what, what do I get instead? Some grey mecha stuff? It's like a Gundam. It is, it is strong software, yeah, because for the Cinder that I was thinking of, uh, yeah, yeah, then I got the Elden Ring into it. Because Bandai Namco said it's been using Elden Ring, so... First I was like, taste, but no, it's a mecha game from, from software. This is the next game, they're tired of Samurais, they're tired of medieval guys, they're like mecha stuff! They're going Gundam on us! Yeah, from software's new game, it's like the fourth mission. Here we go. But when I read it from Cinder, I was like, oh, it's, it's, it's yeah, it's uh, freaking from software. If it's heavy, man, it's heavy, it's mechas. Oh, this game is gonna be awesome. This is gonna be. Elder Ring is already crushing everything here. Pff, gives me a definitely that for mission if you do it. If you ever played for mission, it's a permission, yeah, I lost that for mission. But I guess it's more like sort of the enders, maybe? Yeah, probably. Armored Core 6. <laughs> of course, it's all. I thought it was maybe a new one. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Armored Core is getting in the past. Armor Core is a game that, yeah, of course, they made those games in the past, before they were... What, when, when did I get Rune 3? <laughs> when did I get Rune 3? I love something afterwards. Game of the year. Winner. It should be Elden Ring. Ring. Yes! It, it makes sense. Yeah, it make, the world makes sense. No, it's good, it's good, man. But I mean, when they beat God of War in, in Best Director, then it was kind of like, yeah, I have a hard time seeing it losing now, though, because... That's kind of the same thing, like best directed game and best game is a very similar genre. It's almost the same genre, yeah, best director and best game, so... Um, then I felt that they had it, they had it in... Uh, yeah, much Briefly right, most of the game trailer were very bleak, I kept saying it right. But yeah, they were really, really boring, man, after. 
No city games are boring or whatever, but after beating it for a few hours, you're like, oh my god, it's like the 10th trailer now where the game is gray, black, gray, black, and red. Yeah, and then it's like that for 10 more videos, right? So the few games that have been abandoned now to him, Blue Protocol, you were like, oh my god, look at the colors! <laughs> right? I was like, the colors! You know, I was happy getting like, oh my god, this is color, this is beautiful. I was like, oh my god, finally a game with beautiful colors, right? A game with water and waifus. I mean, not every game has to be a goddamn bleak zombie apocalypse. Apparently, the Western developers, they only want to make that, right? And it's kind of weird, because I worked on one Western game company a couple years ago, and it was very similar, and I hated that in our game. We made a sci-fi game, right? And we had three different factions, you think about like Sword, whatever, you had the cafe with. And they were also bleak and boring. One was very stylistic, or stylistic, but very like clean, you know, white and blue and clean. Boring, I would say. Humans, rusty, they were boring. It was just rust and dark, black and red rust, right? And then we had kind of the Zerg thing, basically, right? And it was also like, okay, kind of bleak and so on. Red and white, yeah. And I was like, why is it no color, right? Why can't one army be a bunch of white No, but like, honestly, more color, blue, red, blue, you know, made the game look more appealing, right? Yeah. Uh, and people say it's Yannick or whatever, but I think most games, unfortunately, in the West goes into that, like my game also did, from the artist crew, and I hated that game, yeah. I hated that game's graphics. And the game was very badly received, on the graphical standpoint, right? But I did ever love, no, but seriously, people really slightly, I didn't do the graphics, right? I just complained about it all the time, <laughs> for three years. And it, but honestly, people hated the graphics, because people were, it was generic, it was like every other game. Everyone's feedback, reviews, the actual players disliked how the game looked, right? Because it was generic, grey mesh, like most Western developers. It's a trend that I really dislike in the West, I guess. Also a little bit in Japan, but especially in the West, yeah, it's like, man, it's... Um, I guess, this is, uh, anyway, guys, please subscribe to tomorrow, right? I'm doing a like, short edit of some of my favorite reaction parts. Um, cut it out and I publish that, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with Black Lore and Ark Knights, right? Uh, anyway, guys, have a great day. Um... It's like evil bath or something because it's like Superman is infected in the first trailer, right? So it's gonna be like maybe evil Batman now. Batman kiss people now, I guess. Cause it's like evil Batman, probably. It's like parasite Batman, right? He's like he kills people now. That's probably what it is. Yeah, evil Batman. I'm gonna be right, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Batman never kills people. They're like, oh, actually, he does now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's evil Batman. Oh, is it Kevin Connors' voice still though? Oh my god, Kevin Connors died, oh. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Kevin. Yeah, they threw in Kevin Connors' voice there though. Oh, the Goosebump Man. Oh, I am Batman. Oh, man. After 30 years as the iconic voice of Batman yeah. in Arkham video games, Batman the animated series, and countless other DC I made a video about that, you know, Kevin Conn report, Kevin Conroy, my, the Batman, yeah. Passed away last month at the age of 66. He yeah, was I got some such cancer and died voice. very quickly. so amazing in the Arkham games, and I know we're all going to miss him dearly. Yeah. Well, tonight, we can share that he will return to Rocksteady's Arkhamverse one final time to play Batman in Suicide oh Squad, God. Kill the Justice League. There's a heavy voice, I guess. Releases. May 26th of next year. Man, really got his video. I guess he already recorded it before he died then, right? Yeah. <sighs> now, as we think